So, uh, we this found this video here. Under a microscope. But so is a this. A microscope's look and at this. why the world is running out of sand. Sand isn't The world thing. is running it's out of sand, diverse. people. And all its this is, a, this is an epidemic. Let's take we're a look. We're on a sand scavenger hunt. We're collecting samples, and we're going to send them to Cory in New York to look at under a microscope. We're taking samples of And we're sand. doing all this because sand is actually one of the most critical natural resources there is. It has a million different uses, but it's a crucial component of concrete. Gotta and have humans concrete, use more bro. concrete than any other material besides water. It's fueling these huge construction booms in places like India, China, and parts of the U.S. China needs their sand. And you might have seen news about the world running out of sand. That's the true. The world is but running out of simple. sand. The future of construction actually depends on the science of each tiny little grain of sand. The science of sand. of sand is really broad it can be i don't know what sand kind of is rock or mineral really what makes quite sand broad sand it's quite a broad science. definition each grain is somewhere between 0.05 millimeters and two millimeters across oh, so, so glad i know how big a grain of sand is larger now. and it's gravel that's kind of it but what sand is made out of where it's from so what boy? it's shaped like Todd, all of that you know is this guy has consumed nothing but soy in the basic lifetime. recipe for concrete is pretty simple Sand and other large rocks get mixed together with it's water like, and cement. I could be out, you know, scoring hot babes all day, but uh, the cement solidifies you know what really gets what really gets me hard concrete. is uh, and what you really studying sand concrete all day for my whole sand. life. The grains so are rounded and their size sand. is consistent. Oh. That helps the sand bind with the cement. It's also made of a nice hard mineral like quartz, without too many softer minerals mixed quartz. in. And river sand. Take note really of that. Really good river sand. Quartz takes sand. all of those boxes because of this incredible journey it goes on. You think about the incredible journey the individual of sand. Grain of sand that was once on the mountain. Gotta get a nice look at That's his face. That's Frank Leaf, a geology Frank expert Frank at a Leaf. sand producing company called Vulcan Materials. More like Frank Basically, the sand in the Sacramento River here started up 400 <laughs> miles away. You know that guy's the soil mountains boy. of Northern California. He looks Very like he eats bananas. Over time, <laughs> little jagged bits of those mountains chipped off by freezing, thawing, rain, wind. Fell down into the into the canyons and then fell into the rivers. In the rivers, he looks like he takes. He wants to take the land back from the white man. Bouncing against each other, hitting each other millions of times. Oh, they go. Is this Minecraft? I think so. Oh. Along the way, softer minerals are slowly dissolving away. So that after 400 miles, you get this. Ooh. What in lots of situations is the ideal sand for concrete. The ideal of course, sand. river sand ends up somewhere too. For concrete. The beach. Yes. It's maybe the most mature sand that there is because once a river it's mature like a milk. Beach, most people think that you hear sound action. with your ear. But beach sand comes and they're right. Its issues. It's salty and it can mess Indeed. with the chemistry of the concrete mix. And it's less pure. There are lots of shells and bits of sea It's like and a girl that's had sex, she's not that pure. No. It's like somebody had sex with the sand. It's you not pure anymore. It's not things, pure. But the concrete might be more expensive or trickier to work with. So, yeah. that's beach sand. That. Anyways, that's beach sand. Oh, for you. he filled up his tank. In case you didn't know. This that, here is gasoline <laughs> Gasoline sand, sand right here. <laughs> Manufactured sand, which is basically what it sounds like. Making small rocks out of big rocks. Crushed sand is He's trickier than natural kind of sand because it doesn't go, go through like that natural soil. weathering process, so it's very sharp and angular. Just a lot. Unlike river sand, if you didn't, you this car is actually made out of sand. Yes. Over millions of years. One hundred percent sand produced. Yeah. Oh, did you see that cement truck? That was really important. Some of that too. They wouldn't let us film inside the quarry, but they gave us a very large sample. That's right. We drove all the way to the quarry for a fucking bag of sand. They probably didn't let him in because they're like, look at this dumb fuck trying to just get sand from us. Here's a Ziploc bag full River of it. And manufactured sand you know why? Because there's an abundance. But they both solve the <laughs> other huge driver of sand scarcity. Sand, sand is cheap scarcity. to produce, but bulky and heavy to ship. Frank says transportation right. of sand can cost we, them We don't have entire fucking deserts full so of sand. sand. usually stays local. The sand you scarcity is real. Dump truck that's driving down the road with material it's probably not going more than 30 or 50 miles from its from the source of where it got its material the source Any of the farther sand. than that and it's probably not worth the cost to move it 
Rivers are so no, why do we? because they cover a lot of ground. <laughs> And quarries can create sand in lots of quarries. places. Do they have quartz? Both of them allow quarries? builders to collect and I use so. sand locally. <laughs> when you don't have ideal sand nearby, Look scarcity at it. gotta scary. protect the sand. In the short term, that's you know, like wrap that sand in bubble wrap. Really I really, I really wouldn't want anything bad to happen to, to, to the sand. That's where you no, get these no, reports never. of sand mafias in India. <laughs> sand mafia. Sand mafia. There's some construction projects in Dubai. Is my is my backyard safe? Places like Australia. I, I think the sand mafia is here still. <laughs> sand. Smooth to work well in concrete. Again, you need the right sand, sand in the mafia. right place for the right job. Oh, never mind. Oh. So how'd we do? Well, we sent the samples to Corey. He got them all organized and imaged. Corey. And we saw a quarry with the motherfucking cor SpongeBob <laughs> cam. Go back, go back. We got it. We got to get a still of that. Need a still of that. I lost all all uh, seriousness in this video. They lost their credibility. When these scientists were filming sand <laughs> with a SpongeBob camera, I've seen everything. We called Frank back to get his take. Oh, Frank Lee? Frank came back. Frank Queek. <laughs> Frank came back from the quarry. <laughs> and he had quartz. <laughs> With the quartz. Is relative to the, to the other sands that you sampled. Frank saw a big contrast between oh, the manufactured the sample or. and both the photos of river sand that we sent him. Both of them have a very high concentration. Wow, they both look like rocks. Of rounded quartz grains. Ooh. It's those smooth quartz grains that work quartz. so well in concrete. As to the beach <laughs> sand, the grains were nice and round, but there were more Ooh. mystery grains in there too. Like this big blue green one in the middle. Yeah, Ooh. fuck that one. Is, is a tourmaline. Uh, it's also found in some of your heavy minerals. All okay, of them heavy minerals well. in the sand. But of course, it's so much more complicated. In reality, is it? each it's one sand. of those grains went on its own <laughs> journey. So even within a single sample collected from one place, there's a whole world of sand represented. Uh, in geology, there's, there's never a... He literally just said perfect. there's a whole so world of sand. <laughs> but we're running but out. <laughs> we are running out of sand. So listen, there's a whole other part of the story oh, we, we didn't go. talk about. Don't let that deter you from knowing doing about all the sand, of the sand harvesting all I think the in world. conclusion we can Subscribe. Say, subscribe for more subscribe awesome videos. Subscribe for more awesome videos. And we can see that, in conclusion, I just don't think the sand is going to survive. They're doing dirt next. One so like subscribe. one like equals one sand. one sand grain. One quartz. One quartz sand grain for the world. <laughs> one like. <laughs> one subscribe, we will mail you one bag of sand from the quarry. No, we won't. We're running the out. The actual quarry. We're, we're running out. We can't send them that.